Vitalik Buterin. If the price is zero, then the network can't be secure. In his recent live stream interview with Laura Shin for the Crypto Journalists Unchained podcast, Ethereum co founder Vitalik Buterin has shared his views on the current situation on the crypto markets and answers a number of other crypto related questions, including the value of Ethereum, F, Industries Regulation, Future of ICOs, and the work of Satoshi Nakamoto. Dot Ethereum price? What's going on? It's not a surprise that Buterin was asked about his stance towards the current F price. In his opinion, the Ethereum price has a strong influence on the entire market. He explained his position the following way. Dot in part, it was counter-signaling to distinguish Ethereum from other crypto projects that do pumping and lamboing way too much. But also it was about minimizing the legal risk by basically trying to make the project seem more distant from something that would be covered by financial regulation. Dot now regulators as well as businesses and developers have started to realize the nature of cryptocurrencies and the fact that digital assets have their value. What's more important, now they understand that blockchain applications can bring significant benefits to people's lives. Buterin insists that despite the fact that many people try to claim that prices do not matter at all, it is absolutely not so. Prices play a crucial role in the network's growth. I can tell you what things are clearly important about why the price being higher rather than lower is good. One of them is obviously security. If the price is zero, then the network can't be secure. That's true in proof of work and proof of stake, explained Vitalik. Moreover, many Ethereum-based projects hold a significant part of their funds in crypto. That's also one of the reasons why prices matter. If the price increases, it means that they are more funded. Echoes still have future. Kuterin agreed that success of Ethereum greatly depended on the fact that the network was used as a launch but for a large number of ICOs. Nevertheless, he highlighted that even without Ethereum ICOs would have taken place and developed. Dot, the only bad thing about ICOs, according to Buterin, is scam. A lot of projects turned out to be scammy and weak which was rather negative for the reputation of other ICOs. Dot, what Satoshi should have done? Satoshi had a really hard job and could not have predicted which way the ecosystem would have went, that it would have turned into something more than a science experiment, said Buterin when asked about his potential recommendations to Satoshi that he would made if he could go back into the past. Dot, he also joked that he would advise the Bitcoin creator to build Ethereum 2.0 following the link on GitHub. And it's not the first time when he tried to show the dominus of F. Now so long ago he compared F with a Samd phone, while BTC was named just a calculator.